Hi guys, Carla here to talk to you about one of the many add-ons you can create and add to your products pages with our ebook commerce product add-ons and extra options plugin. You know with this plugin you can create an infinite number of options, free or paid. Well, in this video I'm going to show you how to create a checkbox add-on. Before we get into it, let me remind you of course to like this video, subscribe to our channel and hit that bell down below so that you know every time we have a new video for you. Now, let's get to it. Okay, so we're in the jewelry section of my shop. And I'm going to choose the silver heart bracelet. So this bracelet is a simple product and what I'm going to do is I'm going to include a checkbox add-on so that customers can choose to get a gift box with this bracelet for um, five extra euros. So let's go to my dashboard. Give product add-ons. So I'm going to create a new block, add block. And I'm going to name it gift box. Priority level one, add options. So as I said before, this is going to be a checkbox add-on. And the title is going to be, how about a gift box? This is going to be the title that shows up above the options that we're going to include in this checkbox add-on. So maybe for a label, we would add a gift box or tooltip gift box. And for a description, add a gift box to your bracelet. I'm not going to add an image and I'm going to change the price. As I mentioned before, I do want to charge my customer five extra euros in case they do decide to get a gift box with this bracelet. So increase the main product price. I'm going to choose the fixed amount option. As you know, we have also the option to choose a percentage. I'm just going to use the fixed amount and I'm going to type five. This is not going to be selected by default and it's not going to be required. It's going to be optional. So the customer can choose to add a gift box or not. Save. Save options. And let's go to the rules. I'm going to choose specific products and categories because I want this gift box to be available only for my bracelet that I showed you before. So search in the product, silver heart bracelet. I'm not going to change this. I want this to be an option available for all users. Save. So let's go back to the site. Refresh. And now I have my checkbox add-on right here. This is the title that I chose. How about a gift box? This is the label, add a gift box. The tooltip right here, gift box. And the description, add a gift box to your bracelet. I can check it right here. And you might realize that this is a square shape. So if I go back and head over to style, maybe by default you have selected the theme style form style. I'm going to change it to custom style. And here you can choose to have the checkbox style either square or rounded. We saw it was square, so I'm going to choose rounded, save options. And if I go back to my site, 
refresh I have now a round style checkbox this is adding the five euros that this gift box costs and add to cart view cart and there I have my bracelet that is now 19 euros because I added the gift box here's the name of course of the product but here's the add-on that I chose to add to this product if I go back to this same self menu eat product add-ons general settings cart and order you can simply choose to not show the options in the car page right here no save options back to the site refresh and now you cannot see the options that i selected so this is how you can create a checkbox add-on change the checkbox style from square to rounded and show the add-on that you have selected for this product in the car page okay guys so that was it for our video today i hope you enjoyed it if you did please give it a big thumbs up and we'll see you again for our next video